Huh. I think the thing to say is what didn't I get out of it? For me, this has been about connection. It's been about remembering who I am. Uh, understanding more the divine, masculine and feminine. And that journey to self-expression and oneness. Um, definitely unique um, in that it was really whole. It was a really whole experience. I felt that... Um, nothing's been missed all the different aspects um well obviously within ourselves and just uh with everything we're, we're really covered covered so well i personally received oh many gifts <laughs> many many gifts um yeah a great sense of oneness a um a much clearer insight and I think, you know, from being in, in this environment and this, this place and the, being with beautiful people for so long, well, for, you know, a number of days, it's given me a lot of clarity and a lot of perspective on life. But, um... oh, what didn't I get? <laughs> I got to come home. There's nothing else to say. It phenomenally just got to sink into myself and come home. Ah, oh, the balance of energies, the 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 all roundedness of teaching. Tanishka with her, you know, her fiery dynamic um, essence that gave us such wisdom um, and you know channelings and um, such authenticity. Um, you know, a lot of missing pieces of, you know, spirituality that I was searching for. And to say that I wouldn't have missed this experience for the world is belittling it. The big us wants, wishes to say that the ex I experienced this for the worlds and for all beings. If you're unable to do this, come to this for yourself, find it in your heart to do it for all others, for our collective consciousness. Thank you. But after being here, um, I sort of worked out a few issues insofar as I found my inner child um, and discovered a lot of stuff that come up that um, I didn't know was there with my f mother and my father and um, basically, yeah, rediscovered my inner child and now I'm walking away more a man than I ever have. So I could highly recommend to anyone to come and do this uh, the Rainbow Bridge tour. It's very, um, very helpful. Mm. Yeah. Wow, where does one begin? <laughs> um, I think mm, just coming back to myself, and being able to work out my real purpose and, um, yeah, giving myself permission to be able to speak my truth. Um, they're such incredible people. It's really hard to express in words, to be honest. Um, but Tanishka um, is so raw and so real and so passionate about everything that she represents. Um, and it really comes through in her teachings and I think that's the most fascinating thing about her is that, yeah, there's no falsity about her in any way. In regards to facilitating, Tanishka just flows with her information and throws in some humour and, and is very, very quick at what comes through for her and interpreting that. She disseminates so much information. Um, and it's it's enjoyable, you know. It's not like going to a classroom or you know, all right, we've got this to learn today, or for the next hour we're going to learn this. It's just you enjoy being there, and you, there's a thirst and a hunger for it. I loved uh, listening to Tanishka when she's really like just in state and in flow and channeling that wisdom that um to me I could just listen to like all day and just and suck that up because it's so rich and so valuable. Good facilitation for me is someone that creates a framework, they know where they're heading, they've got a true understanding and they be the work, but within the framework that they present, they can be spontaneous, 
they can listen to the moment and capture the true magic and the essence of everyone in the group. Oh, I've never done anything like this before. It was this amazing day after day roller coaster of you know ebbing and flowing with the way our bodies naturally are designed, um, working through the chakras and really working so solidly on so many different levels but that focus and that intent and just the awareness that arised within me how you know the depth of what we are and what can emerge when we actually take the time to you know really go within. Uh, Tanishka is just so grounded in her in the way she facilitates um, so natural and so you know awesome um, and you know just makes you feel like you're human if you like you know um, it goes in really deep and it allows you to to transform different areas of your life and I think that's really valuable whereas a lot of retreats focus on one thing this doesn't it covers it all yes, um, usually you go on a retreat um, that's calming and healing in that regard just some time out or is this one I found kind of put me through a juicer? <laughs> Great way. But just, um, so each day was um, challenging, but also you felt like you came out with all the best ingredients at the end. Words fail me on that one. It's just, just do it. Um Look, I'd recommend anyone because it doesn't matter whether you've got previous experience or knowledge on on, on this type of stuff or not. Um, if you haven't, you would you would certainly gain some some insight into yourself, which is the big part of it. It's all about the journey journey within and how that is connected with the environment, the earth, and and spirit. And it's all about yeah bridging that and fight, w realizing that you are the channel between heaven and earth. And so anyone really, I wouldn't recommend anyone specifically, just everyone. everyone. And f for reasons of yes, it's total value. <laughs> it's, it's life valuable. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. If hmm, you're not feeling totally balanced within your life in some way or you need some time out just to reflect about what it is you want from now on and now forward and a better grounding in who you are I would recommend to come just like truth has lots of different spokes to the wheel and lots of different expressions then this has captured every expression of greatness uh, the journey forward and the new paradigm coming in and what I loved was not just the focus on the group facilitation and the experiences we had in circle and that sacredness but the food oh my god it was fantastic and I tell you what that was like the icing on the cake for me um, great workshops and everything if the food was a little substandard probably wouldn't have been the same experience so it was such a big picture of greatness uh, it, it inspires you to either to go deeper or to to go higher if you're searching for yourself and you want to understand how to live life passionately dynamically peacefully this retreat does it all that it's okay to be an elder in society and because I'm 59 and I'm getting on and before to, before this retreat I sort of didn't think that I had it that much to offer but now I realize my wisdom is my wisdom um, I would recommend coming to the retreat uh, basically if you just feel you are here um, for just a purpose that is greater than maybe just what you've identified 
at within yourself. Um, you know, you've got something to offer, whether it is, you know, that, that healing on a global level and, um, and you need to do some processing work within yourself and just the people that, um, that you meet here, you really, you do feel that incredible sense of unity and it's really um, just accelerating that shift in, into that new paradigm that we're all just coming into and um, you know, your heart will just overflow with love from from being in a space like this with um with all of these amazing people. Thank you. But um, yeah, there's there's so much that it's given me.